Hello everybody and welcome back to Medieval. I am Rufal, playing this game for you. Woo! Let us continue. We have an option of two places we can go. And ultimately there's not a lot we can do here, but there is something we can do, so we shall go and do it. The first thing we need to do is not get killed by the frogs. Oh! <laughs> Getting murdered by the local plant life isn't much better. But as one can probably tell by that cauldron over there, we're here to see a witch. Whoa! Yeah, this is not a friendly place. Dan, it's right there. has summoned the witch of the forest me oh it is you Seth Portescue forgive me my lord I have never met a real hero <laughs> Ahem. forgive me just an old lady's little joke uh -huh. in truth I am glad to see you Seth Portescue I need seven pieces of amber that are hidden in the ant's nest. Bring them to me and I can grant you a special reward. I will only offer you this quest this once. Are you willing to give it a try? <laughs> Sorry, didn't I mention I'd have to shrink you to the size of an insect? Now hurry back. <laughs> yeah, I think Dan said it succinctly enough. Hello, sir! Run, little man! If the master found it now, he would crush it like a bag! <laughs> Hark! We can hear the soldier ants approaching! Onward, and meet your tiny nemesis! Right. Well, here in the ant caves, uh, our biggest opponent will in fact be the camera. That and just getting completely lost. Hmm. Crafted by fairies. Huh. Right. Well, seems we're not going in there. I have something better than a club. Yeah, as you can see, in the cramped quarters, the, the camera gets caught on the walls. Just use the daring dash to smash Thank down. Thank you for releasing me, sir. My people wish only to live our lives in blissful harmony with nature. But alas, the wicked egg queen has many of us in prison. Rescue my people, Mr. Fortescue, and you will be richly rewarded. Oh, we, we can use the daring dash to break down, to break down breakable walls, or we can just swat them with our hammer. You know, whichever, whichever you prefer. Or that club over there if you don't have the hammer. But here we are. I shall open the entrance for you. These fireflies are my friends. They will light your way through the darkness below. Shouldn't these fireflies be a lot bigger? Oh well. Maybe they were shrunk too. But down into the ant cave we go. This is a sizable maze, so we'll see how lost I get. And some of the ants aren't even bothered by your presence. Now the ones that have uh, blue legs and antennae, those will actively attack you because those are the soldier ants. Let's see some now! Ants! Take that, punks! I may be tiny, but my hammer is still big! 
Ага! But as can be seen, our objective is collecting some amber for the witch and freeing some fairies. And just trying not to die. Now the soldier ants just attack you on sight. The, the other ants, uh, they come after you if you attack them or if you attack the grubs. Go figure. The simplest way to provoke anything's wrath is to attack its young. Hello, sir! You go splat! Aha! As far as the amber goes, there's a lot more than seven amber down here. But there are only the six fairies, and we want to rescue all six of them. After all, he promised we would be rewarded. And, well, you might be able to guess what an act of heroism would be rewarded with. Especially since we aren't seeing a chalice. Back! Back, I say! Huh. Well, I've definitely been here before. Oh, well, looks like I've managed to wander my way around in a circle. Take it out on some ants. Alright. Now let's try and make progress. <laughs> Where am I? All right, I think I want to go this way. Don't you hiss at me! This way looks inviting! Watch it, punk! Alright! Aha! Fairy! Ants! Death! Hmm. That looks like the way towards the end of the level, so let's come back and go the other way. Because why not? Aha! Take that, punk! Well, let's see here. Any immediate signs of fairies or such? Aha! Take that, punks! And you! Away with you!
Well, we've about got all the amber we need. And we've about saved all the fairies. This is good, ya. Yeah. Ah. Don't you spit your nastiness at me. Yeah, I kind of expect it from you soldier ants. There's our last fairy. Take that, punk. Woo. Back off. <laughs> ah. What we got here? If you are brave enough to go beyond this point, you will enter the chamber of the dreaded Ant Queen. Be aware, once you have encountered her six-legged regalness, there will be no going back. Yes, yeah, so if you haven't found all the amber, or you haven't rescued all the fairies, turn back now. Hello, sir. All right. I might as well buy some throwing daggers. I don't really intend to go back to Dan's crypt for them. Maybe I might run into another set of throwing daggers. Ah, that would be convenient. But let us go and face the Ant Queen. That's to you, punk. Of course, you'd think a soldier ant would, would chase me more aggressively for going towards the Ant Queen. Speaking of the Ant Queen, there she is! We're gonna spend a lot of time I'm running around and fighting her guards. I just need to wait for her to uh, start trying to bring down the ceiling again. Of course, be sure that be sure you've dealt with her with her guards before you start shooting at her. Have you now? Oh! A shield did not survive. This is why we carry around a second one. <laughs> Ow. On, die you! Aha! With exactly 50 crossbow bolts left. That's, uh. That's kind of funny. Oh well. We win! Let us escape. Down this hole. <laughs> Bless me, if it isn't Daniel, Lord of the Ants. Hold still, and I'll remove the shriek spell. <laughs> Here's your amber. Oh, 
lovely, lovely Amber. Here you are, Sir Knight. A wart covered and cabbage smelling old crone I may be, but I always keep my promises. I grant you my reward. And her reward is... The chicken drumstick. You have helped to free all the fairy people from the clutches of the filthy and scum. As a reward, I can grant you passage to the Hall of Heroes. I've never been there myself, but I've heard they got a free bar. Yeah, I've been there a few times. I haven't seen the free bar. Oh well. As for what the chicken drumstick does, I don't know. <laughs> I never use the thing because it's not an actual weapon. I presume it's used for baiting monsters into places, but I don't actually use the thing. The new person wants, wishes to speak with us. Fortescue, you jawless arrow magnet. What are you doing back here? <laughs> what? Call me Mr. Woden the Mighty! How I pity the people of Galomere that their fate should once again be in the hands of a chump like you! Still, I suppose it's not fair to take it out on them. Take my sword and do try not to stab yourself in the foot. You know, I've always had my doubts about you, Fortescue. You're just not cut from hero material. <laughs> well, that's not that's not exactly the friendliest guy, but he gives us the broadsword, and with the broadsword, we have no reason to use the small sword ever again. However, that will do for now. Next time, we shall go to other places. We'll see you then. Later.